Hi, this is Mike. I'm reading Robert Alter's translation of Exodus chapter 35. And Moses assembled all the community of Israelites and said to them, These are the things that Yahweh has charged to do. Six days shall tasks be done, and on the seventh day there shall be holiness for you, an absolute Sabbath for Yahweh. Whosoever does a task on it shall be put to death. You shall not kindle a fire in all your dwelling places on the Sabbath day. And Moses said to all the community of Israelites, saying, This is the thing that Yahweh has charged, saying, Take from what you have with you a donation to Yahweh, whose heart urges him, let him bring it, a donation of Yahweh, gold and silver and bronze, and indigo and purple and crimson linen and goat hair, and reddened ram skins, and ochre dyed skins and acacia wood, and oil for the lamp, and spices for the anointing oil and for the aromatic incense, and carnelian stones, and stones for setting in the ephod and in the breastplate. And every wise-hearted man among you shall come to do all that Yahweh has charged, the tabernacle and its tent, and its cover and its clasps, and its boards, its bolts, its posts, and its sockets, the ark and its poles and all its furnishings, and the curtain for the screen, the table and its poles and all its furnishings, and the bread of the presence, and the lampstand for the light and its furnishings, and its lamps, and the oil for the light, and the incense altar and its poles, and the anointing oil, and the aromatic incense, and the screen of the entrance to the tabernacle the altar of burnt offering and the bronze grating that belongs to it, its poles and all its vessels and the lava and its stand, the court hangings and its poles and its sockets, and the screen of the court gate, the pegs of the tabernacle and the pegs of the court and their cords, the service garments to serve in the sanctum, the sacred garments for Aaron the priest, and the garments of his sons to be priests." And all the community of Israelites went out from before Moses. And every man whose heart moved him, and every one whose spirit urged him, came. They brought a donation of Yahweh for the task of the tent of meeting, and for all its work, and for the sacred garments. And the men came, besides the women, all whose heart urged them. They brought brooches, and earrings, and rings, and pendants, every ornament of gold, and every man who raised an elevation offering of gold to Yahweh. Every man with whom was found indigo and purple and crimson and linen and goat hair and reddened ram skins and ochre dyed skins brought it. Whoever donated a donation of silver and bronze brought a donation of Yahweh. And with whomever was found acacia wood for all the tasks of the work, they brought it. And every woman, wise-hearted with her hands spun, and brought the threadwork of indigo and purple and crimson and linen. And all the women whose hearts moved them with wisdom spun the goat hair. And the chieftains brought carnelian stones, and stones for setting in the ephod and in the breastplate, and the spice and the oil for the lamp and for the anointing oil and for the aromatic incense. Every man and woman whose heart urged them to bring for all the task that Yahweh had charged to do by the hand of Moses the Israelites brought a free will gift to Yahweh. And Moses said to the Israelites, See, Yahweh has called by name Bezel El, son of Uri, son of Hur, from the tribe of Judah. And he has filled him with a spirit of God and wisdom, in understanding and in knowledge, and in every task, to devise plans to work in gold and in silver and in bronze and in stone cutting for settings and in wood carving to do every task of devising. And he has given in his heart to instruct. He and Oholiab, son of Asikamach, from the tribe of Dan, he has filled them with heart's wisdom to do every task of carver and designer and embroider in indigo and in purple and in crimson and in linen and of weaver, doers of every task and devisers of plans. And Bezalel and Oholiab and every wise-hearted man in whom Yahweh has given wisdom and understanding to know 
how to do the task of the holy work shall do all that Yahweh has charged.